Yu Fei Xiao Liang, Wang Yibo. Both Zhao Liang and Wang Yibo are high profile stars in the Chinese entertainment industry. They each conquered the hearts of countless audiences with their excellent performances and unique charm. Let's take a look at these two stars individually. Zhao Liang was born in 1987 in Langfang City, Hebei Province. Her acting career began in 2006, when she participated in the TV series The Family of Gold Fans, and became famous in one fell swoop with her outstanding acting skills and fresh image. Since then, she has successively played leading roles in many popular TV series, such as My Fair Princess and A Thousand Bone Flowers. Zhao Liang has won the love of the audience with her beauty and talent, becoming one of the most popular actresses in the Chinese entertainment industry. Wang Yibo is a new idol born in Xi'an, Shaanxi province in 1997. He first debuted as a dancer and participated in the talent show Idol Trainee. Although he finished fourth in the competition, his outstanding performance won the support of many fans. Later, Wang Yibo joined the group on 9 and became active on the music stage. His excellent singing and dancing skills, coupled with his handsome appearance, quickly attracted a large number of fans and became one of the idol representatives in the hearts of young people. Both Zhao Liang and Wang Yibo are very versatile artists. In addition to acting skills, Zhao Liang also has active performances in fields such as music, fashion and public welfare. She has also won various film and television awards many times and has been recognized by professionals in the industry. Wang Yibo has an outstanding performance in music, and his solo singles and songs he participated in have been well received. It is undeniable that Zhao Liang and Wang Yibo are both clear streams in the Chinese film and television entertainment industry. They have won the love and respect of the audience with their own strength and hard work. Whether on TV or on the music stage, they have shown amazing talent and charisma. As their acting career continues to develop, I believe they will bring more excellent works to the audience and become bright stars in the Chinese entertainment circle. Zhao Liang's success in the entertainment industry is not only due to her acting skills, but also her deep understanding of roles and superb performances. She is good at interpreting various types of roles, from costume dramas to modern dramas, from sweet girls to resolute women, and she can perform them with ease. Her works are loved by audiences in Asia and other regions, so she has also accumulated many international fans overseas. Zhao Liang's popularity and influence have made her the spokesperson of many brands, and her endorsement advertisements have a high exposure rate worldwide. As a new generation idol, Wang Yibo has gained wide recognition internationally. He is active on social media and keeps in touch with fans all over the world. His music works are not only popular in China, but also gain a large number of foreign audiences on overseas music platforms. His international fan base actively organizes online and offline support events, contributing to his worldwide popularity. In addition to the fields of film and television and music, Zhao Liang and Wang Yibo also performed well in public welfare undertakings. They actively participate in charity activities, pay attention to environmental protection, student aid and other public welfare undertakings, make positive contributions to society, and become role models in the eyes of the public. Both domestically and internationally, Zhao Liang and Wang Yibo are outstanding figures in China's entertainment industry. Their talent and hard work have made their stardom more and more broad. As time goes by, I believe they will continue to perform well and bring more excellent works and wonderful performances to the world audience. After Chen Qing Ling, Wang Yibo and Zhao Liang, the traffic floret, played Yu Fei. As soon as this drama came out, Zhao Liang was still very popular, and the joke that made Xia Sheng popular all over the place was confirmed. At the same time, Wang Yibo was completely popular all over the country. Walking on the road, you can see his endorsement within two steps. Compared with teenagers, the preference of middle-aged mothers is a bit more innocent. They think he is cute and hope that he is their own son. Since then, Wang Yibo has focused on endorsements in variety shows, and has also appeared in police dramas and suspense dramas. There are very few puppet shows, which seems to draw a line from puppet shows. The traffic niche that flourished for a while suddenly disappeared. Maybe the boss felt that, like Zio's on, the internet stampede happened before, and the public needed to calm down, lest the new stars who had finally gotten up were directly hacked. After all, fan speeches are not controlled, and they can be named and criticized directly of. But then again, it's kind of like being hidden by the snow. If it is because the fire is too urgent and too fast, it is still necessary to increase time to store knowledge and learn. There have been so many ancient puppet shows in recent years, and I look forward to new additions in the future. Delbin's domestic drama group Banjiao Liang and Madison's express their indignation. 
Recently, there has been a wave of negative comments and attacks on Zhao Liang and the dub and domestic drama group, which has attracted widespread attention. Some netizens believe that these negative comments and attacks are not based on artistic or performance level evaluations, but are based on factors such as personal prejudice, praise and disapproval, and fan behavior. First, we need to understand Zhao Liang and her works. Zhao Liang is a film and television actress from mainland China. She has starred in many popular TV series such as A Thousand Bone Flower, The Legend of Chu Qiao, and Knowing Whether You Should Be Green, Fat, Red and Thin. Her performance has been highly recognized by the audience and industry insiders, and she has been nominated and won many important awards. However, in her acting career, she also encountered some doubts and criticisms, especially in the recent dub and domestic drama group, she was negatively evaluated and attacked by some netizens. The reasons for these negative comments and attacks are manifold. First of all, some netizens think that Zhao Liang's performance is not good enough and does not meet their aesthetic standards. Secondly, some netizens think that Zhao Liang's fans are too fanatical and often attack other actors and drama fans on social media. This behavior makes them feel disgusted with Zhao Liang herself. In addition, some netizens believe that Zhao Liang's certain remarks and actions are not appropriate, and some remarks are even considered inappropriate and hateful, which has also aroused strong public resentment. These negative comments and attacks will have a certain impact on Zhao Liang's personal image and career. First of all, these negative comments and attacks will make Zhao Liang feel great psychological pressure and frustration, affecting her work and living conditions. Secondly, these negative comments and attacks may also affect Zhao Liang's commercial value and career development, and some brands and projects may reconsider cooperation with her. In addition, these negative comments and attacks will also have a certain impact on Zhao Liang's fans, and some fans may feel disgusted and dissatisfied because of the attacks. However, we also need to realize that everyone has their own preferences and opinions. Some people may not like Zhao Liang's performance or image, and this does not represent her own problem. In addition, the performance and image of actors are constantly changing. Different people have different aesthetics and perceptions. We should respect different views and opinions. At the same time, we also need to remind ourselves not to blindly follow celebrities, but to maintain rational thinking and objective evaluation. In short, the incident of Dublin's domestic drama group hacking Zhao Liang has aroused widespread attention and discussion. We need to think carefully and analyze the reasons and effects. When evaluating an actor, we should base her performance and artistic level on the basis of her performance and artistic level, rather than personal prejudice, praise and disapproval, and other factors. At the same time, we should also respect different views and opinions, and maintain an attitude of rational thinking and objective evaluation. Wang Yebo was unwell and absent from the road show. On the evening of July 25th, Wang Yebo's studio posted a sad news on his Weibo, saying that he was sick and unable to attend the Enthusiasm concert in Changsha, so he needed to take a rest. Thank you for your support care. Many fans were at a loss by this sudden news, and the studio released the news very late, which increased everyone's attention to Wang Yebo. However, it can also be heard from the post that Wang Yebo's injury is not a big deal. If something serious happened, the crew would definitely announce his illness and stop all work temporarily, but the studio didn't do that. It means that his injury is not serious. Of course, there are also some conspiracies and tricks, saying that Wang Yebo is not sick at all, but other reasons have affected his work, so he has his own imagination and fabricated some rumors about him. In fact, this situation is not uncommon up. According to the revelations of many Braindead fans, Wang Yebo is indeed a little uncomfortable, because his work is too busy, and he has almost no chance to rest. Even if he is a superhero, he will be tired and get down. From this point, it can be seen that Wang Yebo is not sick, but exhausted from too much work. In order to prove that Wang Yebo got sick because he was too busy with work, some netizens posted a piece of his schedule for July. His schedule is full, and sometimes he will travel for a few days, flying from home to abroad, and one in Japan business meeting. Even if Wang Yebo doesn't do anything, going out every day is still a torment, as the so-called travel and fatigue. Moreover, he still has a lot of things to do, including attending press conferences, recording programs, and rehearsing. It is also fortunate that Wang Yebo is young, so he can bear such a high job. If he were older, he might not be able to survive even a week. It is precisely because of his young age, youthfulness, and the peak of his career that Wang Yebo has no idea how to take care of him, how to take care of him, how to take care of him. In a variety show before, he also said that he was not really sick, and he didn't even know when he would be able to go to the hospital. 
From this, it can be seen that he has taken his body seriously. In fact, Wang Yebo's physical condition can also be seen. In the previous promotional activities, his condition was not very good. He looked very sluggish, and he didn't have much confidence in speaking. He looked very weak and haggard. Even when he attended the Lihua Group's annual grand ceremony before, his spirit was not very good, his eyes were dull, and he was photographed as the focus. Many fans were worried about him, and asked him to take a good rest and not work too hard. Regarding this matter, Nian Han felt that there must be a reason for Wang Yebo's illness. After all, he is famous and well-known, and he is also one of the best in the entertainment circle, so his business is so good. For Wang Yebo and her agency, making money is the most important thing. If she doesn't work hard, she will lose her popularity when she gets old. At that time, no matter how hard she works, it will be meaningless.